Hey, y'all come get this badass baby. She fooled my fur again, my papa ass. <laughs> Bitch, get off my damn fur. Hell wrong with you. Don't look startled. I told your planner's peanut headed ass, stop touching me. Go ahead and try it again now. I'm a two piece your way at the time now. Go on now. Y'all get the damn baby now. I told y'all I don't play with kids. Oh, go on here. He 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 laugh it up. This baby grab my damn fur again. I'ma call the shit up. <laughs> well, there you go. What's going on, party people? What is going on? It's your ride share extraordinaire. Your super duper Uber drivers here, guys. Thank you. Thank you. You far too kind. You guys, you already know the deal. Before you hop in my ride, do me a favor. Hit the like. Hit that subscribe. Por favor. <laughs> Come on, let's do this. Hop on in. Buckle in. And let's go. Okay, okay, party people, welcome back. And if you're new to my channel, thank you for hitting that subscribe button. All right, folks, what are we talking about today, folks? Man, so we had a big night. The swamp was defeated. Yeah, yeah. Nikki Haley is finally done. She finally got the message. <laughs> but she did win a couple of districts. She did win. Washington, D.C., the state full of rhinos. And she also won the state of Vermont, the commonest state of Vermont. Vermont has Bernie Sanders as their representative. Bernie Sanders is a self-proclaimed communist, all right? Vermont also have an open primary, and uh, Joe Biden wasn't running in Vermont. So he had nobody to, to do, um, to go against. So all the Democrats, all the communists, all the socialists went over to vote for Nikki Haley. <laughs> Congratulations, Nikki. You won a state Vermont, but you know, it was good that you, uh, you wasted everybody's time. So now shit out, get out. We don't even need your endorsement. We don't even need your endorsement. In all likelihood, Donald Trump will be the Republican nominee when our party convention meets in July. I congratulate him and wish him well. I wish anyone well who would be America's president. Our country is too precious to let our differences divide us. I have always been a conservative Republican and always supported the Republican nominee. But on this question, as she did on so many others, Margaret Thatcher provided some good advice when she said, quote, never just follow the crowd. Always make up your own mind. Yeah, Nikki, we're good. We don't need your endorsement. You know, matter of fact, go over and uh, support Biden. You know, he needs the help. Take your votes, take your delegates, go over to uh, Joe Biden's side, okay? It is now up to Donald Trump to earn the votes of those in our party and beyond it who did not support him. And I hope he does that. So farewell, Nikki Hillary. Bye-bye. Bye-bye to the sellout. Bye-bye. Bye-bye to the warmonger. Bye-bye to the liberal. Aww. We had enough. But thank you for showing up, though. Here's your cash prizes and exit stage left, please. I am filled with the gratitude for the outpouring of support we've received from all across our great country. But the time has now come to suspend my campaign. I said I wanted Americans to have their voices heard. I have done that. I have no regrets. And although I will no longer be a candidate, I will not stop using my voice for the things I believe in. Unbelievable. So... Trump had a big night. He he was on a roll. The Trump train rolls on. Come and ride a train. And ride it. Super Tuesday for a reason. This is a big one. And they tell me, the pundits and otherwise, that there's never been one like this. There's never been anything so conclusive. This was an amazing 
an amazing night, an amazing day. It's been an incredible period of time. November 5th is going to go down as the single most important day in the history of our country. And now the real works begin because now we can't get too comfortable. All these polls that they have out there saying Trump is winning by five points, six points, whatever. It doesn't count until you go and pull the lever. All right. Don't fall for these polls. I know you're going to say, well, Trump's winning, so I don't have to go vote. No. This time we got to make a statement because you know they're going to stuff these ballots again. All right. So now we all have to show up to the booth, pull the lever, go vote straight down Republican, get them all out. And then um, we have to get ready to rebuild the country again, make America great again. But they come into our country, we're going to stop them. We're going to close our borders. We're going to have to deport a lot of people, a lot of bad people, because our countries can't live like this. Our cities, our cities are choking to death. Our states are dying. And frankly, our country is dying. And we're going to make America great again, greater than ever before. Thank you very much. It's been a big night. Thank you very much. Thank That's my thoughts for today. If you guys got any value out of my content, do me a favor, hit that like, hit that subscribe. You see that notification bell? Turn on that notification bell so you get my latest and greatest. Share this content with your best friends and tell your mama I said hi. <laughs> all right, all right. Till next time, guys, I'll see you again. And all you haters, get off my lawn. <laughs>